my name is Brianna Johnson Shepard. I'm a flight attendant and I'm a first time home buyer. So far, it's been pretty seamless. I don't feel like I've had to do a ton with it. Buying my first home with friends helping me out has been beneficial. I leave and I fly away and I'm gone for days on end and I get phone calls and told what to do and take care of things and I do my minimum part I feel like and then I come back and things are handled so it's been great. My real estate agent is Susie Kermanek and I found her because she's a really good family friend and even if she wasn't a friend I would have picked her just she's hysterical how can you not love her? Being a first-time home buyer for me the lending process was a little bit different again I picked Ryan because he was good friends with of the family. Him and Susie worked together really well. I liked that, that they had a very good working relationship. I knew I could depend on them to do what needed done even when I wasn't in town. It's been a little bit different uh, doing the new construction thing because I feel like I've gone through it twice because I had to do everything once to get pre-approved and then wait a long time <laughs> and then do it all again to kind of finalize the loan, but it's been great. Ryan and his team are wonderful. They send me emails, they send me texts, they call me. Uh, they're always really quick to answer their phone calls because they know I'm on the ground for a short amount of time if I'm in between flights and I have to get it done right then and there. And then they've been patient with me too when I say, hey, I'm out of town for two or three days and I can't get to a business center because it's closed because of COVID in the hotel. So they've been really good to work with. What I'm most excited for in my first home is to know that I am putting money back into my own pocket and know that it's something that it's mine and that I own. My advice to new home buyers that are renting that haven't done it before would be don't think you can't do it because I held off for a lot of years thinking I couldn't do it and one simple phone conversation with Susie and Ryan and they were very enthusiastic for me and told me 100% they'd get me into something and I was shocked to see that that was actually a reality for me so don't think you can't.